away in the green mountains of southern Vermont, you can find Grafton Village. Originally founded in 1754, Grafton is famous today for its historic preservation. Along Main Street, one can see beautifully restored homes, a blacksmith shop, the Grafton Village Store, and the old tavern at Grafton. And of course, Grafton is also home to the Grafton Village Cheese Company, creators of the world-class handcrafted Grafton Village Cheddar Cheeses. It was in 1892 when dairy farmers started bringing their surplus milk to the original Grafton Village Creamery to make cheese. In 1912, fire destroyed the cooperative. Fifty years later, philanthropist Dean Maddy established the nonprofit Wyndham Foundation with the purpose of promoting vitality in the rural communities of Vermont. In 1965, the Wyndham Foundation revived the cooperative with local dairy farmers and created the Grafton Village Cheese Company. The mission of the Wyndham Foundation, our parent company, is preserved through our cheese-making facilities both in Grafton and neighboring Brattleboro, Vermont. Today, the Grafton Village Cheese Company remains true to that mission by working with dozens of local dairy farms, employing over 80 people, and shipping our handcrafted cheddar cheeses around the world. Our success is simply measured by the quality of the milk and employee pride in the artisanal cheesemaking process. Just like it did over 100 years ago, it all starts with the farmer and the cow. The reason that Grafton Village Cheese Company enjoys working with Billings Farm is because the high butterfat milk that we produce, which is also rich in protein level as well, conducive for making cheddar cheese. Um, the milk is delivered to Grafton cheese directly from the farms. Um, it comes here uh, every afternoon uh, because, you know, milk is, uh, is a fairly perishable product. So it's essential to keep that milk as fresh uh, to maintain the quality of that milk that in turn will uh, make the quality of our cheese. And what you're seeing behind us here is the milk that's being ripened. We've added starter cultures to that. What we're going to do next is uh, we're going to coagulate the milk. And that's the principle of cheese making. It's the separation of milk solids and liquids or curds and whey. Um, that's done with a uh, rennet. Once that coagulum is set and we do do the cut, um, you'll see that it actually starts to separate the curds and whey. The whey will be very, very yellow. Um, the curds will maintain that white, white color of the milk. We uh, then begin the cooking process, uh, which takes about, about an hour in total time. After the cooking is done, we transfer the curds and whey out of these cook vats over into what we call finishing tables, where we're draining off the whey and we're going to be left with a curd mat at that point. Um, and you know, the curd mat will go down each side. The cheesemakers take a lot of pride in how their curd mat looks. It wants to be very even. Um, they want to make sure every curd is in its place. Um, when they're done with that draining, what they'll do is they'll cut those into slabs, and then they'll actually begin the cheddaring process. And cheddaring is actually a verb. It is to do something. Um, and the cheddaring is actually the flipping of those slabs. They may have to cheddar several times, or they may not cheddar as much. Um, we'll stack two, then three high, again trying to compress as much of the whey out of there as we can. We'll tear that cheese apart one more time. We run it through what we call a milling machine. It produces what we call the cheese curd. Um, certainly the cheese curd is those small particles, but they look more like uh, French fries. Um, and this is done for the primary purpose of being able to evenly distribute salt throughout the process. Again, same principle as the cooking, we need to be careful how we salt. Salt is driving moisture out of the curd, so we try and do that slowly as well. The curd are then packed back into the 40 pound block molds. They're pressed under pneumatic pressure um, for 6 to 12 hours to make the final 40 pound block that will then be cryovac sealed, go into our aging coolers and uh, maybe not be seen for one to four or five years, who knows. So the cheese makers on the floor really have just such a, a critical piece of the long aging process and everything they do here is just absolutely uh, important. If you're making a cheese that's only going to be around for three months, a lot of these things really aren't so critical to you. That's why we've always approached it as a hands-on technique here making sure our cheesemakers are experienced and making sure that they have the right tools to do the job. The tradition of handcrafted cheesemaking, Vermont Farm Fresh Milk and Company Pride all come together to create one of the world's finest handcrafted artisanal cheddar cheeses. Grafton Cheddar has no chemical additives, synthetic growth hormones, or preservatives. The milk is delicately handled and made into cheese within 10 to 13 hours of having been delivered fresh from the farm. The natural aging and the high protein and butterfat of Vermont cow milk are what make Grafton Village cheese unique and exceptionally creamy. 
When the cheese is properly aged, it is cut, weighed, and dipped in colored wax to denote age and to preserve each of our distinctive flavors. Premium, our aged one year, classic reserve, two year, graft and gold, three year and four star, aged four years. The creamy texture of our cheddar combines perfectly to create our distinctive garlic, sage, and maple smoked varieties. Grafton Cheese also produces specialty cheddar cheeses, like our traditional cloth-bound cheddar and Grafton Duet, a combination of Grafton cheddar and blue cheese. After packaging, all our varieties are ready for distribution to specialty cheese and food shops, restaurants, and for online orders through GraftonVillageCheese.com. Grafton cheese is simply the best cheddar around. It's all natural, it's healthy, it's smooth, it's a nice clean cheese. It's served in, in a lot of my foods, my soups, you know, a few of my entrees. This is a Grafton Village cheese risotto. I've got Grafton Cave Age cheddar in there, which is the, the strongest of the cheeses. I've got a smoked one-year cheddar in there, and I have a regular one-year cheddar, which makes it nice and creamy. So it makes for a nice, you know, healthy dish. Vermonters in general, they want everything local, they want everything fresh, they want to know where their food's being grown, they want to know the farmers they're supporting, who they're buying their food from. So my job is to go out and, you know, get the freshest, best local food that I can possibly get. And that's what I like to use in my kitchen. To get some Grafton Village cheddar for your own kitchen while in Vermont, visit our specialty cheese and wine shops located at our facilities both in Grafton and Brattleboro. We are a specialty cheese and wine shop and of course we built a business around Grafton cheddar cheese but we carry cheeses from all over Vermont and all over the world. We carry the finest imported wines, the best local crackers. It's one of the best experiences you can have shopping in Vermont. In our stores, visitors can watch Grafton cheese being made from start to finish through special viewing windows. We offer a wide range of distinctive wines, each of which has been hand-selected to complement all of our cheeses. In addition, we offer wonderful Vermont products including cheese boards, children's toys, pure Vermont maple syrup, fresh breads, Vermont microbrews, locally roasted coffee, chocolates, books, candles, an incredible assortment of condiments for every occasion and much more. Our specialty food section carries items such as aged balsamic vinegars, Italian pastas and olive oils, Spanish olives, Moroccan couscous, French mustards and other food items not available anywhere else in the region. And of course you can sample all our cheeses along with our crackers, breads and condiments. Our knowledgeable staff is happy to answer questions and offer suggestions on all our cheeses and products. You can also build your own gift baskets and we offer full shipping services. If you crave some Grafton Village cheese for yourself and can't visit in person, go online to GraftonVillageCheese.com. In addition to all the varieties of Grafton Village cheese, you can also order online our sampler collections, specialty cheeses, and an assortment of Vermont-made gift baskets perfect for every occasion. So bring a piece home with you. Savor every delicious bite and continue to enjoy the tradition of rich, handcrafted cheddar cheese made fresh from the Grafton Village Cheese Company.